brought to you by Aaron's Sales and Lease Ownership. Let Aaron's drive your dreams home today. The sixth caution flag of the day has just waved for debris in turn number two. A lot of debris cautions, three of them. But remember, we had 27 cars pile up on lap four. They are still racing in various states of repair. So there's going to be a little debris. Yeah, I mean, you, you, you fix them, uh, you know, as best you can. But then you go back out there and the turbulence of the other cars and the wind blowing, you know, around the car whips, rips stuff off of them. Larry, a big break for Greg Biffle, this yeah, caution flag. You saw his crew up there. I mean, he had completely lost the lead graph. In fact, he was about the last car on the lead lap, so this is a big break for him to be able to get to pit road, try to fix that fender. I bet you that 48 takes left side tires now. I'm going to bet you'll stay out because you know what? This don't put him anywhere close to a window. And you know what the safest place is? Out front. You got it. Or out back. You know, I, I think if you're at the back of this lead lap, Pat, you come in and top off there because that will make you have to take less fuel at the end of this thing. But everybody will still have to make one more stop. Yeah, if the Dodges, in fact, don't are not able to keep up with the Chevrolets as far as gas mileage goes, then they ought to come down and top up. Kevin Harvick threw the dummy toward pit road, pulled back out on the racetrack, but uh, like as you said, most of the tail end or back part of the lead lap cars are coming in. And what this will mean, if it's a green flag stop at the end, less time spent there because less fuel needs. Yeah, I mean, I would take advantage of this right here. I mean, I just think I would come down and get myself so I could come down, maybe just take gas at the end. Or sheet metal and tape, Steve Burns. Yeah, that's exactly what Greg Biffle needs and lots of it. They're going to go ahead and put fuel in it. But their main reason for stopping, Mike, is to fix the right front damage the, to the right front quarter panel. They're manually just trying to slam it with their hands down and then put the tape on it. Randy Gossake, take your time. Just fix that right front quarter panel. I believe, Steve, I'd tell them to pound the sides in more and add more tape because it's been pretty quick that way. This is not good for Robbie Gordon, the 31 car, dragging a fuel can away. Uh, it, it comes loose, but it don't matter. He left his pit box with equipment, so that will be a penalty. Robbie Gordon running in 13th. Yeah, position. that's uh, not what we mean when we say gas and go. No. <laughs> You're supposed to leave what's leave, left. Yeah. <laughs> right. Gas, then go. Then go. We have been expecting rain about 3 p.m. Central Time, as we told you at the top of the telecast. And the rain is on, it's on the radar. The skies are lowering, and it's on the way. So they're going to be racing the rain and each other when we come back to Talladega.